Senator Kirk and I agreed after Patrick Fitzgerald announced uh, his retirement that we would put together a unique uh, first time bipartisan committee, equal numbers of members from both of us to choose the successor to Patrick Fitzgerald. It was a professional committee, bipartisan committee with uh, uh, a lot of big names on it, which we've shared with the press. They proposed four names uh, to fill the U.S. Attorney spot. We reviewed those names and believed that each and every one of them would be acceptable, so we submitted all four names to the President for his review. Uh, the White House has chosen Zach Farden as the uh, nominee that they've sent forward for this U.S. Attorney's position, and we wholeheartedly support their choice. The reason for our meeting today was to emphasize, first and foremost, the need for this U.S. Attorney's Office in Northern District, Illinois, to coordinate efforts to stop the violent crime and murder in the Chicagoland area. We are appalled at the reporting of these horrific crimes that are taking place in this area. We know that there have, has been some progress made. We salute law enforcement and the prosecutors who have done that. But we believe that the U.S. Attorney can play a pivotal role in dealing with the crime and violent crime in this area. The narcotics that are coming into the Chicagoland area, some of them are being pre-positioned in communities like Rockford. The DEA tells us that they've, they're using these logistical uh, positioning of narcotics heading into the city of Chicago, which means a lot of the gang drug activity is uh, leaching out into the surrounding counties that are part of the Northern District of Illinois. I was in Rockford yesterday addressing this issue because of their increased incidence of crime, and we stress this uh, to Zach Farden, who will have a responsibility not just for Chicago and Cook County, but reaching across the northern part of the state. I also uh, brought up an issue which has been raised over and over again by Mayor Emanuel and Superintendent McCarthy. Chicago has per capita six times the number of guns of the city of New York or Los Angeles. We have got to really do everything in our power to stop this trafficking and straw purchasing of firearms coming into the city of Chicago and other communities, wreaking all this havoc and all this death in our communities. So Zach Farden is committed to these things. We talked in some detail about the approaches he can use, the resources he can apply. We made this our highest priority in our conversation upstairs because I believe it is the highest priority of the people we represent to bring peace to these neighborhoods and communities and end these senseless crimes.